And when this government came to power, some people might say that the divisiveness which we seem to be saying right now started during the campaigns, um, you know, which eventually saw this government come to power. And they felt that, you know, a lot more ought to have been done to try and reconcile uh, the country, try and ensure that, you know, whoever feels aggrieved, their pains are soothed. Would you say that this administration has done a lot in that regard? Because some people believe that it's falling far short of what it needs to do to assuage pains and make everybody feel a part of the country. That, that, that would be an unfair assertion to make. I think that this administration has been the fairest under this constitution that we have seen. When problems have arisen, they are identified. Government has re responded by, by, you know, you have seen all of the consultations that have taken place on the instruction of the president spearheaded by the vice president of Nigeria. It had a calming effect in the south-south and in engagement in the, in the southeast and all of that. So now the problem, I think, is that a politician who is barren of issues, who probably has nothing to hold against our administration, this is a government that is committed to infrastructure, you know, accountability, war against corruption. Obviously, they are losers, people who had gained from the rotten order of the old order of the past. So they fight back. And, 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 and whatever it is for them, it's fair. They, they think that it's fair that they use just everything at Buhari. And that's what's happening in the country.